Hey, how goes it? Ken Bozak from the Bitcoinpodcast.com here to talk about Bitcoin and Bitcoin accessories. And today I'm here to talk about the Sentinel Sensor by John McAfee via MGT. But first, let me just go on to say, ah, you like my new car? <laughs> so um, I cashed out a little bit of Ethereum earlier before it's run back up to the 300s. Uh, no regrets. I had to. I had to make a move. I, I wanted to get a car. I got in Ethereum very early, so I sold some Ethereum. I used this guy here, my BitPay Visa card. I used this to sell my Ethereum and hit up the ATM, take out some cash. Now I have a car. I also used my Visa debit card, the BitPay Visa debit card, um, to pay my, my progressive auto insurance over the phone. So basically Ethereum bought this whip right here and Ethereum is paying for the insurance and I'll probably use a little bit of the residual Ethereum I sold, some of the profits I took from it for gas. And then I'm gonna try to Uber and uh, do you know like Swarm City and Lyft and see if I can earn the money back, put it back into Ethereum little by little. Um, I'm not worried about buying back even over the amount I sold it for. Uh, I, I'm very long on Ethereum. So I just wanted to say thank you to Vitalik <laughs> for Ethereum because uh, it got me this new car. So this is a 2010 Hyundai Accent and hopefully I can get it on the road with uh, Uber or some rideshare and make some money back that I put into it. But on to the main event. I did get a package from John McAfee himself. He did DM me. Uh, it was his legit Twitter account. Uh, we're actually, it looks like we're going to have him on the show. So as long as he's up to it health wise, I know recently he's had some issues. So hopefully uh, he's feeling up to it and sooner rather than later, I can get John McAfee on my show. Um, he has already agreed to come on. We're just working on a time and day. But he sent me this package. Personally, uh, this isn't even for sale yet. This is the Sentinel Sensor, the Sentinel product by MGT. Um, let me go ahead and open the box, show you what's going on inside. So, here we have it. This is a nice box. We have the uh, instructional manual. Let's take a look at this. I will make a more detailed video. I just wanted to unbox it and unveil my new car. So, MGT Sentinel Instruction Manual, and then we have Securing Our Tech Future. And if you go ahead and see, you have the new cybersecurity paradigm is here. We have transitioned from the hopeless task of recognizing malware to the task of recognizing the malware creator and inserter, John McAfee. Now, right here you have for additional assistance with MGT Sentinel, visit mgtsentinel.com slash help. Uh, please review the following instructions to install and set up your brand new Sentinel sensor. So the system requirements are 10, 100, 1000 megabytes per second, uh, capable router or switch, web browser, Google Chrome or Firefox, and a broadband internet connection. Okay, so on the inside here, you'll see we have five easy steps and a diagram. So step one, first remove your Sentinel sensor power supply and ethernet cable from the packaging. That would be this guy here, came with it, awesome. Not too many people carry them anymore. Uh, take note and record the MAC address found on the bottom of your Sentinel sensor. You will need this to register the sensor to a web portal account. Okay, cool, all right, next. Ensure your router has internet access and is configured to use DHCP on your local area network. Most routers use this by default, so most likely you'll be fine. Step three is plug one end of the ethernet cable into one of the router's LAN ports and then plug the other end of the ethernet cable into the Sentinel sensor's ethernet port. All right, so step four is plug in the uh, 12 volt DC power supply into a power outlet or power bar. So plug it into the power first, then you can plug the DC power connector into the Sentinel sensor. So the ethernet cable 
the uh, 12 volt power supply nice little diagram now from here you will need to contact our support to register your account which will enable you to use this sentinel unlocker tool now um, with this tool you will be able to configure your sentinels profiles as needed to suit your network environment's personality and then they have the information to contact support uh, please use one of the following options below phone number and email for this product specifically and that's all she got so let's take a look at the power supply very standard 12 volt power supply and here's the sentinel I have to be careful not to show you the bottom but there it is and check this out that's sick right how sick is that yeah <laughs> I think this is sexy I love it I love it look at that I like it a little bit more than a little bit <laughs> I love it. It's cute. It's tiny. I like that I can see the motherboard. I always like to see stuff like that. So that's it. That's the Sentinel product here. The Sentinel sensor I got from John McAfee. Now, I'm not a bajillion percent on what it does, but I do know that it does seek and destroy malware and its creator. What exactly it is that was trying to infiltrate your computer and where it came from. So, Say I'm running this, the Sentinel sensor, and somebody, somebody attacks my computer, virus, malware, whatever. That this product lets them think they have access so we you know, can trace it back and find the source. We can find the malware creator and we can find the inserter. And that right there is the next step. Like John McAfee said in the earlier quote, we have evolved from the task of just identifying malware to now identifying the malware creator and inserter. So this is the next step in protecting your computer. This is a smart router, uh, a, a smart, uh, uh, it, this right here is going to be a paradigm shift in, in internet and computer security. And that is what I'm most worried about right now. I mean, we all have our digital assets on our computers. So our computers are essentially our banks. And our banks are basically the Wild West era of secure, where if a bandit wanted to walk into the bank with a couple pistols, pew, 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 you know, he could just take off with all of, uh, all of your funds. You know, if, if, a, if a hacker comes in and takes your computer and, and you know, could lock it under ransomware, and uh, if you didn't back up your stuff, your beat, or, you know, they could just take over your computer and send your funds from your computer to their computer. This right here is the next step in security. This is like when the Wild West banks upgraded and got themselves, uh, you know, uh, underground vaults that nobody had the keys to except specific managers or something, you know. Um, in-house in -house security guards that had, you know, weapons, stronger weapons than most bandits. You know, this is that. This is this right here. This is my security system for my computer, and I recommend you get yourself a security system for your computer. I'm definitely adding this to my computer tonight. I will be making a more in detail video how to use the product, how to set it up, and exactly what it does more in detail. I just wanted to make this video again to unveil my new car and to say thank you to John McAfee and MGT for the new Sentinel sensor product. I'm really excited that I was one of the first people to receive one of these bad boys. So um, I'm humble. Thank you so much. Hey guys, if you enjoyed this video, please go ahead and smash the thumbs up button. Drop a comment below. Let me know what you think of the Sentinel sensor and the future of MGT with John McAfee. Let me know what you think of what this product offers and if uh, you think that you are interested in one. Uh, don't forget to smash the thumbs up button. Hit the dislike button if you dislike this video for any reason. Just let me know in the comments below how I could have turned the thumbs down around in my next video. Don't forget to click subscribe and flick the alert bell right next to subscribe. And uh, have a day.